Transitions isn't just a project for us at Community Solutions. It's something that's been born out of a real, tangible experience. Four years ago, I experienced um, a period of my life like no other. I lost my auntie to sepsis, followed very quickly by my brother to a brain infection. Eight days later, my father-in-law passed away through esophagus cancer. And then subsequently, I lost my uh, cousin, who was 37 years old, um, to suicide. And there was lots of other health issues around our family. My lived experience has been really important in being able to understand what we, we need and what people around us are asking for. Our volunteers are just amazing. They have such a, a great wealth of experience of life and they understand where we live and what our community needs. What we want to do through our project is really help people practically, emotionally, to be able to, to move through that transition in a positive way. I had a little breakdown beginning of last year where the doctors recommended me to come here. I come on a Monday. I also do a Wednesday morning with the ladies. Community Solutions has given me a new lease of life. I started coming to Solutions about May last year because I'd lost my wife and it's just been wonderful. I go out now volunteering a little bit and I go and sit see a gentleman that's not well and it, it gave me a reason to get up, get out of the house, and come to here, meet new friends and it gave me a purpose in life. I went off uh, work a few years ago uh, with mental health issues uh, and I started to basically build myself back up with uh, therapies and things like that. I come down to the, uh, the men's group uh, and Team Solutions on Mondays. From there I just built up relationships and friends and and kind of proving to myself that I can do it. Over the past six months, people have said I've changed into like a little flower. I've budded. A lot of people have talked about how much they've grown in confidence. People have talked about community solutions being their, their lifeline. You know, like without it, they just don't know like what they'd have done or where they would have been. Um, so actually people's lives have actually massively transformed. What we've learnt through Transitions, we want to expand and scale up the work that we do. We've learnt a number of things that we want to take forward into a new developed project. We can see that there is going to be expansion of some of the services and some of the emphasis on really dealing with the root causes of some of the health and wellbeing issues that we, we see in our service.